April from Crafty Goodness. I am back with a collective haul. So I have um, a few things from Amazon and a few things from Joanne and then a few things from Dollar General. So um, let's get right into it. So first off, Joanne, um, I was in line and I saw this and this year, I don't know why, but I'm obsessed with candy corns. Um, but I got obsessed with them later in the season. So um, I'll probably save this for next year. But it was 90% off um, of $6.99. Now, I don't think all of their stuff is 90% off yet. But this was. Um, they had quite a few, maybe that was why, but it's an LED necklace and it's just super cute. It has little light up candy corns on it and I thought I could use it for crafting, um, possibly wrap it around a, a gnome or something for next year, um, but it's really cute. So I got that. Then I got these little, um, so they're called hitch fasteners, but I think they look just like doorknobs. Um, and these are Tim Holtz, obviously. Um, and yeah, they look just like doorknobs. These are the ones, I don't know if you saw my door ornaments where I paint them and put my own decor on it. And then I put one of the doorknobs right here super cute um, but I was almost out and I believe goodness I think these were $6.99 I want to say you get 12 of them um, and uh, they were 70% off they were having like a door buster or whatever so I thought they ended up being a great price and I needed them so I grabbed those um, my bead obsession is getting real, I just want to say. Um, beads were, I believe, 60 or 70% off as well. I can't remember. I'm sorry. And I don't have my receipt. I have no idea what I did with it. But I got these. These are really cute. They're blue and white striped. Then I got the black and white stripe. These look like 10 millimeter, I think. I like this size. Um, my best friend is doing a lemon theme in her classroom this year. And um, I thought it would be cute. These are the cutest little lemon beads. And I thought this would be cute to put on um, a face mask necklace holder for her and make like a lemon one for her classroom. Uh, for her to wear in her classroom. So I got those. What else did I get from Jo Ann's? Oh, nope, that's Dollar General. I think that's it for Joanne. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let's do Dollar General. So I grabbed this cute little ornament. It's a barn. This was a dollar. Um, I plan on redoing this a little bit because it's, I mean, it's a dollar, so what do you want? But it, um, it's a little messy. Um, I love the little barn door. I'll probably leave that. I don't like that part. I don't know why. I'll probably leave the black and white checked. I might do something else with the wreath, but it needs to be cleaned up a little bit. It's just cardboard, but it's super cute. So I got that. Um, same concept. It's a little house. Um, also a dollar. So, um, I don't know, it just, it just needs to be cleaned up a little bit, you know, maybe a little bit more greenery, maybe some on the other side. I'm not fond of this felt right here, so I'll probably change that. This looks crooked to me, so I need to change that. Um, but again, super cute for a dollar. I found these really cute little, they're called mini rustic bags. You get a set of three and um, it's the drawstring kind and they're small and I don't know, I just thought it would be cute to put something cute in there for Christmas and then put it in a little, put it in a stocking or 
I make advent gift bags for my daughter for Christmas for the first uh, 24 days of Christmas um, of December I should say not Christmas um, so I don't know this would be cute to put something cute in you know drawstring it up and then put it in her in her advent bag so I got a set of those for a dollar and you get three of them I got for a dollar this set of two um, gift bags look how cute this is you guys oh my gosh let me see if I can get this off so you can see. Look, it's like a little winter wonderland in the woods. There's a squirrel and a fox and a raccoon and a friendly snowman. Same on the back. And oh, look at the side. So cute. And then this one is just uh, red and white snowflakes. And then the side. I thought those were great too for a dollar and they're made very nice. Um, I also got this one, also two for a dollar. So it's just a snowman on the front and the back, and he's got his little red and black buffalo check. And then that same design is on the side. And then this is just a red and black buffalo check bag. So I got those. Um, oh, and... This was from Dollar General as well. For a dollar, how, you guys aren't gonna be able to see this whole thing, so let me show you this, the actual image. So, made with love, gingerbread bakery, cookies, cakes, pies, established 1907, open Christmas Eve. They're wall stickers, um, so it's the removable wall stickers. So, I don't know, I like the colors and I love gingerbread stuff, so I, don't, I might use this for some sort of project, but everything is um, separated, so you know, I could use it for whatever, but I just think it's so cute. Like even if I just wanted to use the bakery cookies, cakes, and pies, bake daily, always fresh, like that would be good just for a regular like project, didn't have to be Christmas. Um, so I got that. And then, you guys, you're going to die. This is the cutest thing. Look at this little table lamp. They call it a tabletop lamp. $12. Can you believe it? No cord. So, this one has like a grayish, rustic-y farmhouse gray. They also had a black one, but the black one was a different design up here, and I just absolutely loved this design. No cord, it takes three AA batteries, which I put in so you can see the awesomeness. Look, I don't know if you can see it or not. Oh my gosh, I love it so much. It is so cute. So, um, yeah. Definitely $12 for a little tabletop lamp. It's absolutely adorable. So I got that. Then my last few things are from Amazon. Um, I have some projects that I needed some more spray paint and I needed a red spray paint. I'm doing a really, really cool Christmas craft that I have coming up and I needed red spray paint. This is my favorite red spray paint. Um, I usually get this at Walmart, but they were out, so um, Amazon had it and I ordered it. It was just a few cents more, so I went ahead and got it. Um, this is like, I forget the color, it's apple, apple red, and it's a gloss, and it's the Rust-Oleum brand. Um, awesome. I love this color. Really good for crafting. Um, also, I needed the white. Now, this is a matte. Um, and I think it's just called, just, yeah, just plain white. So I ordered both of those from Walmart. I ordered this tassel loom maker by my favorite craft brand. We are memory keepers. I have so much of their stuff, you guys. I love it. Um, I hadn't bought this yet because I didn't need it at the time when it came out. Um, I have found myself making a lot of tasks. 
So right now I have like a little piece of cardboard that I just wrap around and wrap around when I'm making my tassels, which this is essentially the same concept. So it'll tell you like this tassel will be two inches, four inches and six inches. But I like this bottom piece right here because I'll be able to get my scissors in better and it's just gonna be so much easier. So I got this. Um, really excited to play with that. Then I ordered these super, super cute bow beads. So they're beads, but I thought they would also be so cute as embellishments on stuff. And they're like pastel. So they had, they had another um, color pack with like primary colors, but I just thought these were precious. Like look at these colors. They're so pretty. They're like buttery and oh, I just love them um, so you can see the the hole is right there for if you want to use it to string it for whatever which would look really cute on tassels too but I originally I just got them because I thought they look they would be really cute for embellishments um, and there's even this really pretty mint color oh my gosh love it so I got a pack of those and I'll link um, all of the Amazon stuff that I that I got, I will link down below for you in case you're interested. My last item, and my last item from Amazon, is I've been into making, uh, I don't even know how you say it. Oh, I'm going to get it wrong. I ordered a whole bunch from um, AliExpress. They haven't come in yet. Uh, yet. Um, but it's like those little trays, I think they, I think you call them like cabochons or, oh my gosh, I'm totally butchering it, you guys, I'm so sorry, don't, don't get me for it. Um, but it's, the concept is you take one of these clear little glass pieces, right, and then you have your little tray, and then you can cut out whatever image you want. This is the one inch size, so I actually have a one inch punch, so I would, you know, take whatever, um, pattern or whatever I want behind it just so you can see and then um, you attach it you put you take your little tray and then you have your little cutout of the paper or whatever you could even use a photo and then you put this on top and it makes like a charm or a pendant or anything so um, a little button so I got a pack it's actually two packs this one and this one. I like how they wrapped them and packaged them though so they don't get cracked and broken. Um, yeah, so that is everything I got from my collective haul. And like I said, I will um, link um, all of my Amazon stuff definitely down below. Um, and thanks for watching you guys. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And I will be back um, I have, a, I went shopping this weekend, so, um, I still have two Dollar Tree hauls to put up and a Hobby Lobby or Michaels haul. Um, so yeah, so please stick around for that. Like, subscribe, and hit that bell notification so you can be notified of any upcoming videos. And, um, thanks for watching, you guys. Have a great day. Bye.